Hey everybody, I was trying to go live, but it wouldn't let me be great. My connection would not let me be great. But I wanted to come in here and just uh, thank you guys for accepting my invitation to the 30 for 30 group. And congratulations on taking this step in your health and joining me for 30 days. I will be coming in here in this group with videos and tips and questions for you and i really want to encourage you guys to participate because as you come on uh, into this group like pin it in your facebook app as you come into the group and read things watch videos um, share your progress you're going to feel more connected and you're going to feel um more accomplished as you are sharing your progress and as you are checking things off your list that you are doing and how you are participating and i'm hoping and praying that that will encourage you to stay consistent with your routine so um, as i said i'm going to be talking about 30 factors um, to um, successful being successful in your health journey so today, um, the first one that I wanted to talk briefly about is belief, okay? So I wanna to talk to you guys about belief. That's one of the first things that you really want to have solid when you are going on a health journey or when you're renewing your commitment, because um, let's face it, it's almost September. Many of us at the beginning of the year, we had certain goals and things we wanted to do. And then um, throughout the year, maybe we said we're gonna get ready for summer, we're gonna get ready for back to school or get ready for an event. But I think it's so important for us to continue to set goals, continue to reset, to assess you know, how you've done, be honest with that, and then reset and recommit. It's something that I am starting to do literally every month um, or just in 21 or 30 day periods, just say, you know, hey, yeah, such and such went that way last month, last year, whatever, it went how it went. I can't cry over the spilled milk, right? But um, I assess that period of time and then I recommit to what I'm going to do with that next period of time. So that's what we're doing with this 30 for 30. So like I said, the first one is belief. So what I want to encourage you to do is get a hold of your belief in yourself. Get a hold of your belief in yourself and your ability to accomplish the goal that you have before you. One thing that helps you with um, believing in yourself and believing that you can achieve a goal is writing it down. It seems so simple, so trivial, almost cliche. But I want to encourage you as you think about what you want to do for this next 30 days is to write down your goal. And when you write it down, I don't want you to write it down and just be like, okay, yeah, that would be cool. I want you to literally believe that you will accomplish it. Picture yourself 30 days from now. Picture yourself on September 22nd, 23rd, having accomplished that goal. Is it two inches around your waist? Is it um, losing two pounds? Um, is it having victory over your addiction to sweets? or carbs? Is it sticking to a particular diet? Is it learning a new skill? Uh, whatever that thing is, I want you to see yourself on the other side of that. 30 days from now, having completed it, and I want you to smile and just see yourself having accomplished it. And do you know that if you continue to set these goals and believe in yourself and stick with it, three months will pass by and you will have accomplished three sets of 30-day goals. So that is the first step. It is the first thing I want you to consider as we go on this 30-day journey, and that is belief. Belief in yourself. So write down that goal. If you're bold enough, send me what that goal is, and then begin to write out 
your plan for how you're going to accomplish this. I did not start this 30 day challenge with this whole list of things um, for, for you to do every day because I wanted you to start with that mindset the mindset of belief, even believing that you can stick with this journey, even believing that you can accomplish this goal. So let's just start there. And then tomorrow I'll post some things and I'll comment um, and I'll put in um, another video with some other things for us to add. Um, but the main thing I want you to do is have that belief in yourself. Write down what it is that you are believing you can accomplish all things through Christ, right? We can do all things through Christ who strengthens us. Um, take a picture of yourself, maybe record a video of yourself talking about what you're planning to do within this next 30 days. Um, and we'll get ready for the next part of the challenge on tomorrow. All right, y'all have a good one.